The expansion valve limits the pressure in the brew system by releasing a few drips of water when the pressure reaches 11 to 12 bar. There is no air compressed in the brew system, so the water, as it is heated, will expand until it is released. If the expansion valve is worn out, it will bleed off pressure prematurely and limit the brew pressure. It is normal to read 11 to 12 bar when the machine is at idle. We've set this expansion valve to a point that is too low of a pressure so that it leaks while we're brewing. Although we still have 9 bar here, we're losing water here. Then when we turn off from brewing, the pressure drops off and doesn't achieve a, a maintained pressure above 9 bar. So now we'll adjust the expansion valve to achieve above 9 bar. Turn the expansion valve base clockwise to increase spring pressure. Test by running the group and then cycling it off and watching your needle climb. We're still not quite at the pressure we're looking for. We'd like a little bit more, more pressure. We're going to turn the expansion valve base a little bit more. Run your group, turn off the group, and we're adjusted back to where we need to be. It takes a little bit of effort to get it just right, but the parameters are again on the brew gauge, 11 to 12 bar, while the system is heating but not being used.